and greetings. Welcome to video number eight on our series of customizing ISP config. On this video, what we'll learn is how to start managing users and also the difference between a user or a client and a reseller. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right in. I'm going to log in as freelance. Oh, here goes freelance tech. Uh, oops, wrong password. So here we are logged in as the freelance tech is the client, uh, which was C1. And you notice that right off the back, he starts seeing all his stuff just like the admin would, but you'll start noticing that his toolbar, his or, his or her toolbar is way shorter. Now he has access to manage his sites. Uh, and let me zoom in. So we'll start dissecting this. He has access to websites, uh, databases, users, and so forth. So just, and he has access to his DNS. Now, Let's log in as the, the second user, that marketing. So I'm going to log off. And it was, uh, here goes marketing sales. Now on this one, you'll notice that he, he or she has more tools, just like the administrator. The difference is, that you'll start noticing that he, this client, or excuse me, this reseller does not have anything yet. He does not have any clients because he is the equivalent of the administrator. He's the, but he is, the hierarchy would be obviously the administrator and everybody below him. So this reseller could then turn around, create clients. So let's just assume that is a client that sells a uh, web space. So he's going to, he's going to start creating a client, the new client. And you'll start noticing that now his customer ID is R2 because he's a reseller and he's a client number one of the reseller. Um, hopefully that starts making sense, um, in the sense of why would you want to do this? The idea is that is designed um, basically to sell space, uh, internet space. So if you have an infrastructure that could handle um, the selling of space and so forth, this would be the, the piece to manage it. Um, the idea behind it is obviously it's free. That's one of the key features, yet it's very, very powerful. And it also, it's already groomed to accommodate a lot of selling points where you could just go out of the database and start adding it from there. So I definitely didn't get deep into it, but at least you start seeing the gist of it. Um, at this point, we, we'll start navigating deeper into it, but I, I want the next couple of videos, I want to start showing how you start tweaking a lot of these things. Um, again, all that good, Chad, subscribe, thumbs up, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks a lot.